tonight, Iran is playing Qatar in the semi-finals of the Asian Football Cup. That's like the World Cup of football, but for Asia, for all the Asian countries. This is a big deal. The reason why it's a big deal this time around is there's only one country that has won more Asian Football Cups than Iran in history, and that's Japan. And we just beat Japan in the quarterfinals. And the other country that's in the finals right now is Jordan. So if we get the finals, we're probably gonna win it all. And then Iran will be tied with Japan for the most number of wins in AFC history. But the thing is, Qatar is a really good team. Are we gonna win? Are we not gonna win? Let's find out. Iran and Qatar face off in the Altamama Stadium to see who will join Jordan in this year's Asian Cup final. See, many had to come from behind against Japan to book their place amongst the final four, while Qatar needed extra time and penalties to find a way past Uzbekistan in their quarterfinal match. The
it was rooted to the Swiss title. behind him, few as they thought the ball was about to drop for them. Ah, oh, there's two of them. I don't even know what to say, I just feel... I don't even know how I feel, I feel like I've lost. We played so well, we had so many shots on goal, we had so many goal line defences, we were 10 men. For the last 10 minutes of the game, we were one man down and Jean Bach almost scored. So we came so close to scoring so many times. Man, I can't begin to imagine what the players of Iran are going through. That dressing room right now must be oh so sad. My heart goes out to them and I hope they don't take it too harsh. You made us proud with the bravery you showed on that field and it's in times like these that I'm grateful that you're there with me. Maybe we didn't lose because the game is longer. I don't mean the match, but I mean the game. Maybe there's more to this story than just this. Let's see. The World Cup. 2026.